Welcome to Motley Fool's Crunch Time series, where we scouted a single company from their story to their opportunities and risks. Today, I'm covering Archer Aviation, the vertical takeoff and landing aircraft maker. I'm going to start with my prediction. I think Archer Aviation can beat the market over the next 10 years. Could be a volatile ride to get there. But let's get started with the company's business strategy. Archer Aviation is developing a vertical takeoff and landing aircraft. It's going to take off a little bit like a helicopter. There's more propellers than a helicopter. It's also electric, so it's quieter. And those front propellers can actually turn so the aircraft flies a little bit more like a traditional plane, can reach up to 150 miles per hour. The company is still pre-revenue, but it does have deals with the U.S. Air Force, Japan Airlines, and it's building a commercial air taxi service in Abu Dhabi. That's going to be really the first testing ground for the company that could potentially launch late in 2025. The company is nearing their FAA approvals for the aircraft itself, and once that's approved, then we should be off and running to increasing production, so late in 2025 and early in 2026, that's when I think we're going to see the business start to ramp up. But what's that growth opportunity look like? Once the aircraft can actually fly and take customers, Archer Aviation has a number of options for growth. It can sell aircraft to other customers, like military customers, other commercial operators. It can also build this ride-sharing business, if you will. That's exactly what it's doing in Abu Dhabi. Its biggest competitor, Joby Aviation, is doing the same thing in Dubai. And this could potentially be a really disruptive market. Think about the convenience of a helicopter with the speed of a traditional aircraft. Layer in something like the ride sharing convenience of Uber and you have potential disruption and an expansion of the market for short point to point travel. Not just from an airport to downtown, but think about flying from New York to Philadelphia, LA to San Diego. That could become much easier with a company like Archer Aviation. Now this is a market that barely exists today, but analysts think that it could be worth $39 billion by 2033. Of course, with a pre-revenue business, there is always risk. Given there's no money coming in the door, Archer is losing money, not only in net income, but also free cash flow. And that's going to continue. That could mean more capital raises, including a $300 million raise today as I'm recording on Tuesday. We also don't know when their final approvals for their aircraft are going to get completed. And there's questions about the business model. What are the margins going to be if they're selling aircraft? What's the revenue and margin picture look like for that air taxi service? There's also competition. I mentioned Joby Aviation. There's also other companies that are trying to get into this business. So it's not a guarantee that Archer Aviation is going to be the winner or that the business model itself is going to be phenomenal long term. Those are risks that investors are going to have to think about. Well, what's my prediction? I think this is a new market and potentially a much bigger market than both something like helicopters and private aircraft. That's really the two areas that it's going to be disrupting. I think that could be a very attractive market long term. Add in the military applications, and I think RV Archer Aviation is going to do very well. It's very difficult to predict exactly what the business is going to look like, but typically these disruptive companies are where investors want to be. As aircraft start to take off, potentially later this year or early next year, I think we could see the stock start to do really well. So to recap, Archer Aviation is a leader in vertical takeoff and landing aircraft. It has a chance to be a market-defining company. This is a new business model with short point-to-point -point transportation that could have a very big market. There are a lot of risks, but I think the potential reward outweighs the risks. Now, in The Motley Fool, your comments make us smarter, so please comment with your own research and insights about Archer Aviation and tell us what stocks you want to see next on Crunch Time. Thanks for watching. We'll see you here next time.